Here's a glimpse into an apocalyptic future. That's what's coming out of an international conference on global warming this morning in Brussels. After all night negotiations, more than 120 countries signed on to a report that says 30% of the Earth's species risk extinction if average temperatures rise by 3.5 degrees in the coming years. It also predicts drought, hunger, and disease. Ten of the world's natural wonders are now at risk, including the Great Barrier Reef off Australia. James McDonald of ITN takes us down under. It's a chance to experience a spectacular world beneath the sea. But to these divers, a visit to the Great Barrier Reef is serious business. Reef Check Australia keeps an eye on the health of the coral. And up close, you can see just how fragile it is. Corals have been around for huge amounts of time, and yet there's, there's several different pressures that can actually affect them as, as a sort of like living organism. Often called the world's largest living organism, stretching 2,000 kilometers, the Great Barrier Reef is under threat. It's faced over pollution, but nothing quite like this. A recent report by the UN's Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change said global warming could make the reef functionally extinct within 50 years. We're not acting fast enough to combat climate change, and we need to do that in order to save reefs. Reef researcher Selena Ward says a rise in sea temperature can lead to widespread coral bleaching, which can kill off much of the coral's life support system. Millions of people rely on reefs around the world as a source of food. They protect coastlines from damage, and the natural beauty attracts plenty of visitors. We're in the heart of the Great Barrier Reef, off the coast of northeastern Australia. And even on a rocky day like today, you can still have a clear view of the coral reefs and the marine life that lives here. No one is sure how it will adapt to climate change in the long run, but there is consensus on this. The thought of an Australia without the reef is unthinkable. It would be a dreadful shame if they, they weren't there as a source for us and for our children in the future. I think it's a call to action and a wake-up call to all of us. James McDonald, CNN, on the Great Barrier Reef, Australia.